okay guys in this video tutorial we will learn that how we can make a key press event handler within the Matlab. for it first of all we must know that there is a built-in function within the Matlab that is wait for button press it is actually a function provided by Matlab and it will listen to our key pressing activity that whenever we will press any key like a b or any alphabetic or any numerical key from the keyboard it will take the ascii of that key and it store it inside the key underscore press variable this is just a variable the main thing that works is our wait for button press function then this double command and then get gcf current character used to get the one of the handle from the whole function and convert it into the double double format double is just like integer but with uh, also included some like uh, decimal numbers etc so then after converting it into the double it will store it inside this value variable again this when variable is just a variable you can write any value like uh, you can also write val underscore zero uh, like this and now we are going to run it now when we will press a it will give us the value 97 okay now again we will run it and when we will press b sorry it will give gives us 98 so we can also modify it like uh, if well underscore 0 is equal to is equal to 98 and message box okay now then we will write that message box is pressed sorry it's a b is pressed b button b is pressed so now we will run it and when we will press b then it is written it is that button b is pressed so you can write any other value like uh, okay like uh, 100 okay we will press c which is it is 99 so uh, we will press d now okay yeah because here we wrote it it's equal to equal to 100 so we must have to replace this value as well and why we have put these two equality operator because we want to compare this value underscore 00, zero and 100 that either value underscore 00, zero contains 100 or not and if the condition is true message box will pop up like a, like this button d is pressed so hopefully now you can create a simple key press event handler within the matlab so thanks for watching